welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we are the voices inside your head. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT. I ain't no idea, Clover One, and we are playing uh, the Dot Shot Racing. Yay! Let's try a different car this time, too. Uh, this is a drift machine, dude. I kind of like that. Yeah, you won with the fast the car, dude. Of an I drove a fast car. I did. With a fast car on a map with a lot of straightaways. It was great. Boost. Bank your boost. Wait, there's a boost? Ooh, you got a little booster? Dude, I know there's boost. Hold on. There's one. Can I do this real quick? Look at this. Inside baseball, you're seeing it happen right in Ooh. front of your eyes. I'm going to go ahead and turn all of these down just a little bit. And this down about right there. Right right there. And I'm happy with that. Make sure it's in play. It, it's still happening. And the race is on. See that? Look at that. Ooh, the race is on. Seamless. <laughs> Seamless. You didn't even notice it happened. In fact, it didn't happen. Jones. What just happened? Uh, you put your finger inside. I mean, you play the game. Oh, dude, we're in the freaking rainforest. Man. Oh God, where's where's uh Bolsonaro? I don't know what that is. <laughs> the the, Excuse the me? Brazilian president. <laughs> I don't know what it had. It's something like <laughs> What? He just made up a name? <laughs> yeah, it's something like Balls Naro, dude. Oh, is that offensive? All the people are named Balls Naro, aren't they? His last name. His, na his last name is B O L S O N A R O. Balls Naro. Oh, wow. I was holy crap. Jar Balls Naro. Jar Balls Naro. All right. Wow. Fair enough. Yeah, he's a. He's a Else, dude. I don't really pay attention to other people's news, but uh, you don't pay attention to the world, bro. Nah, nah not all like that. Yeah, dude, I check out the world news subreddit. Like, it was all about COVID for a very long time. Now they're actually getting into like real world news. I check like uh, world news maybe like once a week. Gotcha. Uh, Russia is stacking troops outside Ukraine right now. Now they're worried it's going to be a giant conflict. Oh, they're posturing. And there's a uh, coup going on in Myanmar. Yeah. And they're no, killing a lot was, of people there. I was, uh, I remember I was watching the lady workout video for that. Oh, where she was. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> She's like doing yoga and all the, all they're like yeah. going in to like overthrow the government yeah. at that moment. I was like, man, this is so Oh, that's that. That's still going on. Okay, I thought that was because people are protesting and stuff now. They like, oh, shut man. off the internet to the country and stuff. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's crazy. Yeah, dude. Russia's already warned that if uh, people get involved, they're going to be bad. And like, people are like, Russia, you are bad. Right now. You know what kills me, Jones, is that I don't understand like what kind of sociopath you have to be like to, to seriously take over a government or like what, what are we talking about here? Right, dude. For one thing, government is not about like it's not about like the school systems or the bus or all <laughs> the other. It's like that stuff is part of it, but it really it's about allocation of funds. It's about where the money that they tax the citizen goes. Yeah, yeah, and power, dude. Yeah, like, and how much of that money like, take over the world? But how much of how much of that money goes into the pockets of the people who make the decision? How much of that money goes to you know the building streets in certain cities and that can all be influenced man it's it's kind of it's kind of sick and i honestly i feel like it takes a very special person to even want to be president like you gotta be a little crazy yeah dude, like, I feel you. every every president has <gasps> a he he blew you at the end dude every every president's got a little trump in him <laughs> wow. I'm just saying, this is true. Yeah, dude, I, I feel you. Yeah, all of them I are would, like, I'm trying to think if there was any government office I would like be interested in being in. Uh, I'd be a senator, maybe. A senator, Jones? House, house of Senator, dude. Senator Jones? House of Rep, dude. To be a rep of the Senate, dude. I don't even know what they what the, what my job would be. Isn't it just like paperwork? You get <laughs> money and vote, dude. They give you money and you vote. No, but what do you like? What do you vote on? You though? filibuster, dude. You just oh talk. God, this guy. Not, nobody's filling any busters. No, right? dude. You represent your constituents, and like when they do stuff, you're like, my people would like this. Like everything else. And then you vote on their behalf, man. And people I mean, call your office and stuff and be like, vote on my behalf because I like schools to do this. I mean, that's great, and all, but. Uh, 
like what did what did they vote on? Like what day the trash like, get picked like up? Like law changes and stuff. Like that fourteen hundred bucks you got in your bank account. They voted on that. They put that bill together. I can have that. Oh yeah, why don't you give it to me then? We can have it. Dude, I'll take it ain't yours. Four, I'll take all the fourteen hundred dollars I can get. Uh, you, they, Are you lost they can I bet have it on. It. I bet on a dog race. They can have theirs back, and they can leave me alone. How about that? Wow. How much stimulus did they give us? Thirty-two hundred bucks over a year. <laughs> yeah. It's like less than three hundred bucks a month. It's two two rent payments. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, for like, yeah, a person living by themselves. Yeah, it's like two to maybe three rent payments, yeah. God, dude. When I lived in Cleveland before I moved to Austin, my rent was five fifty. <laughs> right? <laughs> dude, rent in Cleveland was so cheap. I, was, I guess. I, now, I had a small one-bedroom apartment. Don't get but me wrong. But still, rent in Cleveland yeah, was so cheap. Yeah, and it went cheap. from like four seventy-five to five fifty, and I was like, what? Yeah. I remember yeah. when my ex-wife... When we were moving to Austin, I was like, "Just, I was like, I don't care. Find, find a cool place. I'm in. Show me a few, and we'll, and we'll, and we'll vote together on where we live." And she was like, "Yeah, the rent will be X amount a month." And I like choked it, and I was like, "That's per month." And I was like, "Every month we gotta pay that." <laughs> <laughs> I was like, Whoo, "That's not like a three for one deal. That's every right? month we gotta pay that that's much." So much. I got I got the same like uh, culture shock when I moved to Florida. And I was just like, oh. <laughs> yeah, you're just like, wait, that's that's like that's for half a year, right? Yeah, I'm like, this place isn't even as nice as the one I'm, <laughs> I lived in in Cleveland. <laughs> right. Exactly. Like, where's the pool? Yeah, isn't there supposed to be a pool? You're like, it's called the ocean. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it really was too. <laughs> Like, oh, this is Florida. Is there everywhere is a pool? Yeah, the pool is everywhere. Don't you see all those people riding on the street in boats? Um, yeah, dude, I, uh, paying yeah, rent is thing. sucky. Paying <laughs> rent is sucky. Yeah, but you dude. know what, you know what, you know, I don't know if, if your mom ever hits you with this, but, like, you know, well, geez. Oof. That was a good one. Paying rent is great because it means that you are in your own place, man. And yeah. It's, and it's your rules, your regulations. Yeah. You clean your room, mom. <laughs> All right. right. The next one. Charlie. All right. That's all the time we have this episode of Crazy Town. So please make sure to like and subscribe. If you already did that, make sure you hit that notification bell. And uh, yeah, we'll be like, we did it. Jonas. Hey, Dead Nancy. last. We are out. <laughs>